Love 247 and I'm coming to you with a hair review and it's the hair that I'm having right now. So this is the Havana Mambo Twist and I just got it done, just got it done probably like three weeks ago. But yeah, it's very lightweight, it's very easy to manage. But, so there's some downfalls about that, and I'm going to get into that as we progress. So there's pros and there's cons. I feel like the pros and cons balance out themselves because the pros are, it's lightweight, it's fast. This hairstyle only literally took two hours. So those are some of the pros. Some of the cons are, it gets messy really, really easy. Like, I only had this in for three weeks, and it's already, like, frizzing. The Havana Mambo Twist, like, I don't know if you noticed, but... In the it gets it, it, it you feel like it's dry and that's why I have this on me 24 7 because I'm literally always spraying this on my hair literally always spraying this on my hair because you think it's dry and you're like is it is it really like can life really be that dry like you just you just start to question yourself another con is that if it's if it's not braided properly under there if whoever didn't braid your hair like um under it because you know Havana because you gotta crochet it in then your edges will be playing peekaboo <laughs> all day and all night <laughs> so yeah your edges will be playing peekaboo so it's like I would definitely get this hairstyle again it's not like um it's ruining my life but just make sure what's under here, because that's what's really important. That's where people that's that's where people mess up. They don't they don't focus on what's under because even with um, bondings or sew-ins, if the if the whoever did your hair did not mold that thing to your hair correctly, it's gonna fall out the next day. Or if that person didn't sew it in um like tight enough, that means like your new growth is gonna like take over your whole sew-in. Like y'all know what I mean because Whoever's watching this video, y'all trying to get this because y'all don't want to have to worry about that. So, yeah, so I, I say get it, but just make sure whoever do it knows how to braid really tight and just knows what they're doing. Just simply knows what they're doing. Like, I guess you could say had experience um, by doing it, knowing the pros and cons, knowing what to do, where to place certain twists. Like, um, when I was getting my hair done, she told me that... Um, she put a lot of it on the side so it can look really full and I feel like that was a really good technique so that's something you could take with you and also she said in the back you know when you braid it um when you braid it she said like she sews it so it won't like the little pieces of your braids the end of your braids won't be falling out One thing I do to maintain it is, um, like I said, washing, but sometimes I will like take the scissors and you know what? I don't know if I'm ruining it like this. I will take the scissors and I will like, okay, I'm, oh, this shit gonna go all, all out of focus. Um, scissors and I'm not sure if you see like this little piece right here, this little piece and I'll just chop that off. <laughs> just, just chop it off. Like, just chop it off, you know? So, um. Yeah. All in all, I love this hairstyle. It's really easy. It's really, it's really cute too. I got a lot of compliments on it. Um, the person who did my hair, she was really good. Also, it's just that she, she told me from the get go that she's not really good with the braiding. But honestly, I just, I trust her. I know her, and I was like, hey, and hers look good. So what's up? And this still looks good. It's just uh, my edges are just slightly pulling out a little bit. Just a little bit. It's just slightly put them out, but you know I'm trying to slick them with some spritz, some some gel. But um, um, yeah, that's what we want to do. Oil sheen, spritz, gel, and a blow dryer. I almost forgot the main thing. The blow dryer. You gotta blow dry it down. Let me repeat that. There are four keys to success. Your your hair oil, oil sheen, hair oil, anything. Your spritz your gel and lastly your blow dryer you will need that for the edges boo make sure you get that real quick okay. so i just want to thank you guys for watching this video if you like this hairstyle give this video a thumbs up and, and if you don't like up. this video you can suck my ass because you're no good and better than everybody else <laughs>